All right, guys, you heard of getting your mojo on. Well, today I'm going to show you how to get your moho on, as in moho sauce, which is a key ingredient in a lot of Cuban recipes. What I'm going to do for you is show you how to take this sauce and make some really killer pork. Okay, right here we have, I've been uh, sauteing, or rather marinating this all day long in moho sauce. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a little flour. In this case, I'm using coconut flour, but you can use regular flour as well. And I'm also going to dip it in some cornmeal. And I've got our plate set up, so we've got about 50% of each. And all you got to do is take your marinated patties, dust them liberally with flour, get your oil nice and hot on the pan, and away we go. This is going to be a perfect foil for our Mexicali corn salad, which we've already made. And I'll show you a few other little niceies once we get this thing going, but it can't get any easier than this. This is what you call gourmet Cuban cuisine, done the easy way. Unfortunately, they haven't come up with smell-o-vision yet, but boy, that does smell good. What you want to do is let it cook. Since these are thin patties, because these are pounded pork, I mean, you can also do this with chicken as well. But since these are pounded pork patties, I'm going to let them cook for, I'd say, about two, three minutes a side. You want to let them get a little brown. While you want some oil in the pan, I mean, you're not deep frying, okay? So you want to have enough to basically coat the pan, but not so much that it's underwater. If the oil starts spitting at you, it's obviously too hot. All right, let's see how these bad boys are doing. I usually put a little more oil down just to get it started. And we'll give them another few minutes on that side and then we should be ready to plate them and have our side dishes. And there you have it guys. Just a like a mama Cita used to make. Enjoy. See you next time on Man Cave Munchies.